Yo, what is going on everybody? It's Juan Solo here with A-Squad Gaming and welcome back to the channel. Thank you all so much for tuning in today for some more Tom Clancy's The Division 2. So in today's video, we're actually going to be taking our first in-depth look at the character customization that we're going to be having in The Division 2. So for those of you guys that actually played the private beta as well as the open beta, you guys would have noticed that the character customization was very lacking at the start of each of those betas and it basically made it so that you had to pick between pre-set up characters and that was the only customization that you could actually make to your characters. So in the Division 2, that is not how it's going to work in the full game. So actually over on the Division 2 Twitter, they actually tweeted out a video today showcasing really the first look of the actual character customization. And personally, this takes me back to like the old Tiger Woods PGA Tour days when you can literally customize like everything about your character when it comes to like your facial features, your eyebrow height, your cheeks, and everything around that. You can customize it very in depth to make that Division agent exactly the way you want it. And as you can as you can see here, we're looking at some of the footage up on screen now. And at the start, you down at the bottom, you guys might be thinking, oh, that's not very much clothing to choose from, but that's, that's you get, I think, six pieces of clothing or whatever, like there, your pants and your outfits and stuff like that, so that it allows you to kind of choose your starting kit when it comes to what your character look like, and then obviously when you're out in the open world, looting all of the different clothing and all sorts of cool things, doing missions and stuff, you're going to find more outfits and more cool clothing and stuff for your division agent, but I'm just really excited to see this amount of detail when it comes to creating our agents, because if you guys don't remember in the first division, you got to kind of select from a few different heads and a few different body types and stuff like that but for the most part you really couldn't customize your agent and being the fact that this is a third person you know it's a cover based shooter but you get to see your character so it's really nice for them to let us make our characters look exactly how we want them to look and I cannot wait to make my division agent on day one next week but for the most part guys that's pretty much all of the video I will link that tweet down below so if you guys want to watch it for yourselves you're going to want to go over there and check it out watch it over a few times or whatever just to kind of see if I missed anything go Go ahead and do that. The link will be down low in the description. But like I said, that's all for the video. If you guys enjoyed it, you guys are excited about the character customization in the Division 2, make sure to slap that like button and also subscribe to the channel if you are new to stay up to date on all Division content moving forward to the launch and post-launch next week. But for the most part, guys, like I said, that's all for the video. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out.